Good evening, my name is Hudson Horn, address is on file. I want to share with you a verse from Ephesians chapter 2, starting in verse 1. It says, We were dead in the trespasses and sins in which we walked, following the course of the world, following the prince of the power of the air, the spirit at work among the sons of disobedience, among whom we all once lived, skipping ahead to verse 4, but God, rich in mercy, because of the great love with which he loved us, even when we were dead in sin, he made us alive together with Christ, by grace you've been saved. See, the reason I bring that up is to bring the point to you that the only thing that can take a person and bring them out of a state of sin is the grace of God. You see, the reason our world has been stuck in sin, the reason there's things like hate and violence and genocide and all these things is because the entire world is dead in sin following, well, the course of the world. And the only thing that is going to change that is the gospel of Jesus Christ, that he came and died on the cross in our place so that we can be forgiven and made right with God and be restored by him. No uh, bill such as Bill 334 is going to change a person's heart in that way. And um, nothing else is going to do that. That's why I come here to share this with you, and that should be... Thank you, guys. God bless you. Thank you.